Hey everybody, how are you? This is Kate Lanigan MacGregor, and do I look a little foggy or is it <laughs> I've been on the computer all day and I'm, I'm thinking I look foggy, but anyway, um, the reason, so today's moment of dot 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 is on authentic reviews. And before we do that, I just want to share with you a funny story. So I was trying to video us in the back and we have this little pool set up. So you now here's the funny story. My daughter bought that little pool online for her dog. Okay, so it's like one of those little things that that's about two feet, three feet high or whatever. So she bought it for her dog. And so, you know, it's been kind of out there and the dog went in at once or whatever. So my husband, you know, gets behind it and, you know, levels it off and fills it up and gets a filter for it. And, you know, now we have to watch the filter. So now this little, this little pool that was for the dog is now so clean that my husband doesn't want the dogs to go in it. <laughs> So the dogs had a lot in the dog pool and yesterday my two of my nephews came over and they jumped in the pool So I thought that was pretty funny. I think my husband's been in it. My daughters have been in it So everybody is in the pool except those poor dogs. So anyway, I wanted to show you it because I thought it was pretty funny uh, So anyway today my serious topic is about authentic reviews so I'm working on our just GBU authentic marketing and the training today is on um, reviews and how to, and what your reputation is and how to get reviews and, and whatnot. And it's kind of interesting because when I was talking yesterday with somebody about this, she said, isn't that kind of like, you know, anti-authentic if you're asking for reviews or you're looking for reviews or whatever? And I thought about that and I said, well, you know, you, you want the reviews to, to reflect who you really are. Hi, Joanne, how are you? Hi Susan, hi Peter. So so yes, in a way, like reviews are, you know, you hope that they're generated and authentically and you hope that they actually accurately portray you and your business. Uh, however, that being said, I mean, people believe reviews more than they believe you. And they believe reviews from a stranger more than they do for themselves. So it is kind of interesting, you know, but how do you ask for a review? And what do you do to get reviews? And how do you direct them to where you want that review to be? Do you want it to be on Google? Do you want it to be on Real Satisfied, uh, LinkedIn? You know, so where do you, because you can't ask one person to put reviews in your 10 different locations of where you think people may be looking for you. So anyways, there's a lot of different questions that get asked about this. Hi, Michelle. And, um, and there has to be a strategy behind it. What I'm gonna give you today is a tip on giving reviews. So if you want reviews, your best bet is to give reviews, okay? So go to LinkedIn and start reviewing those people who you respect and who you like, but also who will possibly and probably give you a review back. Go to those businesses that you have enjoyed or whatever and, and hope that they start the chain of giving reviews also. And hopefully what we can do in our world of abundance is that as we're giving out more reviews and as we're doing more of this, everybody will chime in and everybody will get, get stronger at it. Okay, so authentic reviews to me means absolutely getting the reviews so that people can find you when they go looking for you. Okay, the second part of that is um, making sure that you're doing the same. Okay, contribution is really the bottom, 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 most important piece of almost all business building. Okay, all right, so anyway, have a great day. I think I might go in the back and go back in the doggy pool.